What is going on everybody? It is about 7 in the morning and today I am here in a very special place in Greenville, South Carolina at Southeast Game Exchange. It's a video game expo and it's the biggest one I've ever been to. And I got here super early today in hopes to get in there, meet some vendors while they're setting up, make some friends, and hopefully make some deals. Yeah, hey. hey there. Watch your stuff, man. I appreciate it. Oh yeah, of course. Thank you for Steven watching. Have we met before? No. Okay. So. Well, good to meet you then. Yeah. I just, Are you set up here? I am. I got a booth over there. So. Okay. I don't. There you go, man. That's all yours. Are you serious? Yeah. Thank you. That's an amazing <laughs> gift. What's going on, Jerry? Hey, Caleb. Signed up for any Smash tournaments today? He's not playing. If, if we're not too busy, I want to so bad. <laughs> nice. That's awesome. Is this you guys' booth right here? It is. A lot. Wow, today. you got a lot. A lot sold yesterday, huh? Dang. It was bad. I, I'm out but, here too late, apparently. <laughs> just want to say, man, I watch your channel all the time. Hey, I appreciate I that. Support you. I subscribe. Thank you. Yeah, I, I appreciate you and that. Chase. I love Chase. I, I love him come too. Down here. Excuse me. I was just wondering, um, do you guys have any like semi older sealed stuff? Uh, like really anything older than last gen? Yeah, I got you. Uh, we got a couple teams actually. Would you mind? Could I take a look at the um, Zelda? Thank you. But yeah, I think I will go. Are you guys open for business yet? Uh, if you give me just one second, I can get it for you. Okay, sorry, I don't want to rush uh, you. You're good. Alrighty, so first pickup of the morning, got this brand new sealed Zelda Skyward Sword. Now, uh, I paid 120 after tax for this guy, which is right around what it goes for. The comps were actually all around, all over the place, selling from between like 80 to 150. So this is about what it goes for. Like I said, the reason I still pulled the trigger is the seal looks really nice on it. So this is going to go into my pile to go send to WADA and get graded. And I think it should do really well once it is because this is just an absolute classic. The new one is coming out. So I think there should be some solid demand. I came on out to my car to put this with some of the other sealed stuff that I found on this trip to make sure it doesn't get damaged by anything. And I'm also going to pick up the only thing that I'm selling at this expo, which is this booster case of Chilling Rain Pokemon cards, which I came to a deal with another vendor on before the actual expo. Hey there, got my thing. You guys here yet? Yeah, I just have to send it to you. Oh yeah, what's oh, the awesome. Paper? Thanks for bringing these again. I know you said you weren't gonna think Happy about to. it, but. Happy to, no, that's all right. I. Glad to get him out of my closet. All right, first deal of the day has gone down $630 for that case of Chilling Rain Booster boxes. I believe that was $105 a piece and I paid like 85 or so. So it's only like a 120 or so dollar profit. But like I told those guys, they're out of my closet now and you don't honestly expect to make a ton on wholesale product. But it's great to start off a conference with a big sale. I was gonna say, are all the reselled Game Boys 150? The ones up here? Yeah. They're gonna be between 150 and 250. Okay. Some of them have uh, backwards on it. Gotcha, thank you. Uh -huh. So, tell me this. You said you can do custom Game Boys. Uh -huh. Can you do like any anything custom? Yeah. Oh, that's so nice. Can I see that? Tap to stop to change the brightness too. So, my favorite Pokemon is Poliwhirl. Could you do a Poliwhirl Game Boy? Yeah. That's pretty tempting. Because these look really good. I honestly, this one, this, are super cool. this one's really nice. The 8-bit style on that is awesome. Is that Lavender Town in the background? That's amazing. Oh my gosh, how about those custom Game Boys, folk? And by the way, if you guys can think of a cool color scheme for that, that's kind of what I'm chewing on right now. Let me know in the comments, of course. By the point this video is posted, I will probably already have it, but I'm interested to hear your thoughts nonetheless. Somebody hit me up first thing yesterday when I was getting set up, it was gone, so I don't even remember what it was. I remember See, I've been sit telling everyone I made, I made a mistake not getting here earlier. Yeah. Well, do you have uh, any wiggle room on this guy? I remember. Yeah, do 35. Just 35? Yeah, if you want to do that. That'd be great for me. Okay. 30 and 5. I appreciate it, man. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. Hey, man. Looks great. Thanks. All right, this is a solid like 25 to $30 on Amazon after fees, so 10 bucks is pretty good. Have to clean it up a little bit, but not bad. And this is amazing, too. How does every booth have one of these incredible oh, yeah. display <laughs> cabinets? This is crazy. That's my pride. 
Wow. So is this just, this isn't for sale? It's not. I mean, unless it's like- That's what the other guy said too. He said, he said, I have a, I don't want to sell it price, but that's it. All righty, looks like this guy, it is loose, 15 bucks, but should still be able to get probably at least 30 on Amazon, so that's not bad. What do you have on the uh, Super Strikers jersey? Uh, 150. 150? Yeah. It's so cool. And then she got, I got this in the same, it's like a baseball jersey. What size is it? It's a lot. It only is one, like they only had this size in it. It's a large. Oh my gosh, it's so cool. Yeah. <laughs> I met a former employee that 2005. Me, but, it's so cool. Appreciate that. Y'all selling yet? I don't want to rush you. I mean, you. if you want to look, but not everything's priced yet. We're getting okay. No problem. Still, I won't. I'm still trying to. I hid stuff last night, so I'm still trying to find it all. Yeah. I had 200 on that. Okay. It's worth. I mean, it's pretty cheap, but it doesn't have a charger with it. Oh, I gotcha. And it's the uh, the first edition with the OLED. Mm -hmm. Did you look this guy up yet at all? No, it's uh, looks like that a couple of them sold for like 200, uh, 140. I'll do like I'll do 120 on it. 120, pretty minty. Yeah, that's definitely not bad. I couldn't uh, I couldn't talk you down to 110, could I? Now, that I saw the price of some for 200, <laughs> I'd Fair enough. Sell it on eBay and, I saw I saw yeah. a couple that were in the 120, 130 range, but yeah, those were older though. Okay. Yeah, the prices I mean, on those, they uh, fluctuate a lot. Yeah, especially in this condition. Yeah, I mean, it, it was looking nice. I'll go ahead and do the 120. All right, cool. That's not a bad price. Especially with the case, man. Yeah, well, th yeah, that's really nice. <laughs> you know this one, um, Tamashi, you know what Tamashi is? I don't, I'm not familiar with that. PS4 games out there. Really? Yeah. That's awesome. Yep. What are you charging on that? I'm just curious. Uh, probably 500. Wow. Yeah. I hope it sells. That'd be great. I'm not even, I'd rather keep it, but. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so it's from Limited Rare. Oh, yeah. I gotcha. Right on. Well, good luck. Holy cow, 1200 for sealed sapphire version. That is amazing. Looks like this booth has some sealed stuff. Uh, Batman. Wah, wah. Oh, hold up. Mm. Oh, they do have some sealed stuff over here. Looks like Smash Bros. Brawl might be sealed. Oh, they've got Rhythm Heaven and Fever, that one that I found for a dollar, my claim to fame. Ooh, and this is one of the more rare Wii U titles too, 300 bucks for Devil's Third. Ooh, they've got Sealed Breath of the Wild as well, 155. Man, based on how my current one is doing, I may honestly have to pull the trigger on that. Sealed Wii U Smash Bros. All right, so it's looking like there's actually a decent bit of variation here. Like this one is about $30 over what it's going for on eBay, but this one is uh, quite a bit under. So I may actually pick up, well, probably not that because it's the uh, Nintendo Selects. But these two I probably will go ahead and buy. And then I may also pull the trigger on some of these other sealed ones. We'll see. All right, I got a couple of them here. Appreciate that. Yeah, appreciate you, bro. Y'all have a good one. Is that your bag? Yep. All right, fill it up, man. <laughs> I'm doing my best. One game at a time. There you go. Found one more sealed deal over here, 35 for this. Looks like it's been selling in the 60 to 70 range, so that's pretty good. One shot right there. Morning. Hey, how are you? Good, how are you? I actually know who you are. I actually watch your channel, Mitch. Appreciate that, thank you. Yeah, my name's Caleb. Hey, Caleb, how are you? You said Mitch? Yes, sir. Awesome, you mind if I take a look? Go I don't ahead. wanna, You're okay. Cool. My PS3 backwards pattern was $9,000, like a true yard sale. <laughs> I think that was awful wrong. That's a deep cut right there. You definitely been watching. Yeah, 
it later. Does this Game Boy work? It does. Okay. Might be able to do those guys. Pretty solid deal on that. Oh, and we got Peach and Mario 2. Cool. Uh-oh, Mr. Rightway. Hi. Good to meet you, man. What's up, brother? Can How's it going? Yeah, That's me. Man. How you doing? What you trying to get? Oh, oh so deals. This what, so this is what you use? This is what I use right here. Okay. You hit up any pawn shots while you're here? No. I hit, I, hit, I hit some on the way down, but I was like, eh, around here, odds probably aren't great. No. All right, well, I got... I got 153 bucks worth of stuff here. Okay. How are you paying? You got cash? Yeah. I can do cash if it helps. Yeah, I do better. Uh, okay. You can how much? 153? Yep. 140? Sounds good to me. All right, let's do it. Good enough. He got it. There's, he got it. Uh, I have two. I might have to get That's some good, change. That's good. All right. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Yeah, man. That's come, awesome. Come back by. I will. I'll come by a little bit later. Okay. Well, folks. No big deal, just hanging out with a couple of YouTube icons right now. Well, Living my dream. My wife says we're like the just the old people on YouTube at this point. I'm, like, I'm the oldest she, one. She's not yeah. wrong. Well, it's so. definitely been an inspiration to me. It, it, I really feel like I've made it meeting you guys. Hey, and I'll be honest, I am very happy because I found you very young in your channel and to see you blow up like you did. Numbers don't matter to me as a person, sure. but it's just cool to see someone's journey just explode like that. Oh, uh, well, awesome. thank you. Also, yeah, he's, I'm hoping to... He's really awesome. I don't know if I ever told you that. It's pretty handsome. That's very too. generous. He, he, yeah, he's go on. He's go of, on, please. He's keep, keep, keep it coming. Nice. Look at that. Yes, Look at that. thank you. Are pretty firm. <laughs> yeah, biceps pretty nice. That's that doesn't girl. always come across on screen. Wait, wait, but he still has soft skin. He does have soft skin. Yeah, soft skin. <laughs> so, wait, has what? Soft skin. Oh, soft skin. skin. It's all. His, I'm his translator. <laughs> yeah, it's soft skin. <laughs> Whatever. It is what it is. Amazing yeah. meeting you guys. Yeah. And if you guys haven't already found Pixel Game Squad, get out from under the rock you're living under. You don't yeah. And subscribe I, I, live to on, I live under a rock. Oh my gosh, this might be the coolest section I've seen yet. Look at all of these 90s Pokemon toys. Wow, that is amazing. We got even down to like the marble game down here. So cool to see. Okay, man, I honestly may have to get this Hitmonchan and Hitmonlee. So cool on a crispy tag too. Wow. I'm not press the wallet about that's what they're going for. Oh really? Yeah. Yeah, these I would I would just put these on my shelf. These are amazing. Well, and they're in such great shape too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I love it. All right, I might I might have to do these too. All right. What's that? This is something that came in like a kids meal at Burger King from what I found. This was a Burger King toy? Yeah. Wow, Burger yes. King's gone downhill, man. Look yeah, at that. Yeah, yeah. Crazy. Yes. Yeah. That's real cool. Yeah, yeah. All right, I think I might have to do these two. Really appreciate that. You've got a great booth here. Thank you. Wow, that is crazy. How do you even get your hands on one of these? So I think you just had a relationship with somebody, like a friendship I mean. Yeah. Somebody at Nintendo or maybe GameStop, I'm not sure. Dang. So it's missing the key to the back, but I'm sure you know a lot of stuff. All right. That's a cool piece for sure. Yeah, and I'll check these out also. Yeah. Mario Sluggers has actually been going up in price recently. That could be good. Guitar Hero Smash Hits for 10 is a good deal too. And this is another sealed game that for some reason is going for a lot more in new condition on Amazon than used. Looks like 44 after fees, so that's not bad. And these looks like I'd be at 70. There's 50 and 70. All right. Thank you, Caleb, Appreciate right? you guys. That's me. Caleb, yep. All right, so just picked up a few more sealed games. We got Epic Mickey for 10, Abba Dance for 20. Believe it or not, the lowest copy was like 60 something. And there's a random ugly mug getting in the background of my collection? shot. <laughs> oh, dude, you've been looking yeah, for that man. game. Yeah, man. Yeah, dude, these are all for my collection for sure. Have you uh, started to. Uh... What's it called? Uh, Speedrun this game? Speedrun Abba Dance. Yeah, That's how everyone really asks me how I'm in such good shape. Yeah, it's really speedrunning this game. Yeah.
Alrighty, so I brought the famous retro Rick here out to my car to uh, where murder my, him. Where am I famous at? <laughs> Nowhere. <laughs> so anyway, I'm dropping all this stuff off, but I wanted to bring him out here because in a deal recently, I got something that I knew I had to give to him and I wanted to get oh, your reaction to it on camera. He's good at this it's too. It's not, okay, it's last not time, N it's not an N64. last time I gave him a somewhat rare N64, this one is not on that level, but I, I think speechless. you'll like it nonetheless. And it might be the kind of thing that you can still get back in your luggage, which is good. It's right here. Oh, yes! <laughs> Dude, this is amazing! The vintage Power Rangers towel. Oh. <laughs> this is awesome. And I just literally, someone just hooked me up with this 3D wall pop from yep. the 90s, 1993. And it, it, immediately when I saw it, I was like, okay, now's a good time. I've got to give him the other vintage with Power the Rangers. Power Rangers freaking towel. Because you've been getting into that with your son more, right? Yes. Dude, yeah. this, this will be what he uses at, at the pool. <laughs> That's the amazing. Pool. Thank you, man. Yeah. Someone gave that to me randomly in a deal, and I was like, I'm not super into Power Rangers, but I know someone who is. Thank you, man. Hope you love it. I love it. But yeah, folks, we're looking really good from the last few hours or so of buying. We've got all this stuff we're putting up. We got a good number of sealed games. This one will go for like 11 or so. We got these that we just found and these awesome Pokemon souvenirs. I think I'm going to give one of these away in the Discord eventually. I can't decide which one, though. Honestly, they're both so awesome. Then we got these few sealed games, too. A couple of Zelda Wind Wakers and a Spyro uh, Legend of Spyro New Beginning. A couple of higher end Wii Motion Plus remotes, some Game Boy Colors. We got this Fire Emblem that'll go for like 70 for 35. That one I need to be careful not to lose. A couple N64 games, all kinds of systems today. Really exciting. And then also this sealed GBA game, which I'm going to have to be really careful with, but also excited to send that boy in for grading. Oh, well, folks. Editing Caleb here, and guess what? As I'm going through this footage, I'm realizing there is far too much good stuff to cram into just one day one video. I'm gonna be having more stuff come out in the future, so don't you worry. But I did just wanna jump in here and say that over the course of the two days of this game exchange, I had so many people come up to me and say that they enjoyed my videos and the kind of content I've been putting out. I was taking pictures with folks and even signed two autographs and I just the whole weekend felt so blessed to be doing what I'm doing. So I wanted to say a really heartfelt thank you to everybody who shook my hand or gave me some encouragement this weekend. It really just, it totally made my month. I've never experienced anything like that as a YouTuber before. And I just felt so much love and support. It was really great. And if you guys enjoyed this video, I think I'm going to be having at least three or four more Siege videos coming out on this channel. They're not going to be immediate. They're going to be staggered over the next month or two. But I do think you guys are going to really enjoy them. And until then, I will catch you guys on the flip.